Hey, good morning. We are at our home that's under construction at 2192 North Desert View Drive in Washington, Utah. And just wanted to give a quick status update since it's been a while since our last video walkthrough. Had quite a bit happen since our last walkthrough. I can't remember exactly where we were at. I think we might have been at framing last time. Uh, so we've got uh, paint on the walls. We've got our doors, exterior doors and windows in. Um, Got some tile work going up, so we'll go walk through here real quick and show you where we're at. Uh, the front door came out exactly as we were planning. And on the outside, there's a mirrored front door, uh, so it gives a little bit of privacy during the daytime. We've got our office here, and the door's over there in the closet. It's a double door, kind of mimics the front door here. Instead of a four panel, it goes to the five panel, but otherwise it's gonna look very similar. It's gonna have a little cohesion there, and that's gonna go here. Got our laundry, we've got the tile floor down. That's a 24 by 48 inch porcelain tile. Um, the color is called chalk. And um, a reminder that runs into the master closet and into the bathroom there, which we'll still have doors on that. Hallway to the two guest bedrooms. Nice view out there for now. There will be a home there eventually. Well, it's kind of a bummer, we'll take away that view, but uh, we'll still have some some views out here, especially when you go outside in the backyard, there'll still be some views. Anyways, guest bedroom here, our Jack and Jill bathroom. We've got the same chalk tile, but in a 12 by 24 format, it just fits the scale of the room a little bit bigger, so I want a little smaller tile there, so it doesn't look quite so awkward with such a big tile in a small space. All right, we've got our shower tub combo, the tile surround, and that tile does go all the way up to the ceiling. That's 10 foot ceiling, just for reference. Got a little bench there. Up. Our other bedroom here has a little taller ceiling. It has a little grander feel. Lets in a lot of light in this room. Um, we've also got windows out to the uh, out here to the um, courtyard area. Just poured concrete. They haven't finished it yet. They're actually just pouring the back, so they'll come back and finish this while uh, they work that concrete in the back. Let's head over to the master. Gonna go through the, uh, through the closet here. So again, nice big closet. It's almost the size of a bedroom. <clears throat> We're gonna have our dual vanities. So one here with the cabinet that goes floor to ceiling. And then another cabinet floor to ceiling and then the vanity here. And then we've got our dual head walk-in shower. Okay, there's that. And we're going to have a linear drain there, so we'll give it a nice finished look. Our master. So I was prepping it for tile. As you can see, there are tiles over there in the corner. It's pretty similar to this color, but it's going to be a 24 by 24 inch square tile as opposed to the 24 by 48. There's Derek, our contractor out there working hard. All right, so we get into the main living space. And I really like the way that these ceilings turned out, just something a little different. The nice coffer there. Love the way that the uh, fireplace is turning out. That is a 24 by 48 inch tile called, um, oh no, I can't remember the name of it. The, I'll call it charcoal, but I don't know if that's right. Anyways, it is a polished tile. Um, kind of sets the tone here. We're gonna have lower cabinets here that are gonna be painted in an iron ore color. So it'll be similar to this color. And then also uh, you'll have three shelves, oops, shelves up here uh, that is gonna pretty much match the flooring, which is gonna be a, a um, white oak in a light stain. Um, so bring in lots of light and kind of soften and warm up the space a little bit. We have our island here five by 10 island, and then cabinets uh, from here to here on the lowers and then uppers as well. Have a 48 inch range top uh, Thermador appliance package. Uh, this way we'll have cabinets, floor to ceiling, all the way over to about here-ish. So we'll have our floor to ceiling cabinet here, and then the double oven here, and then I'm sorry, the refrigerator here, the double refrigerator here. So one full-size freezer, one full-size refrigerator, then your double oven, and then you're gonna have your entry into the pantry, which will be a hidden cabinet door. So it'll look like that's part of the cabinetry. 
All right, we've got our pantry here. I'm gonna try and wrap this up real quick. Guest bathroom. So this will just be a step-in shower here. Okay. Again, linear drain, floor to ceiling, tile. Last bedroom here. It's kind of your standard bedroom. And then let's go out and peek at the garage and then we'll wrap that up. Actually, I might get a peek at the front. We're gonna be out there. Pardon the mess, we do have contractors on, on site working, so they gotta have their tools and supplies. But um, there's our doors waiting to get installed once the flooring goes down, which will be uh, later this week. Have the wood flooring get started. And then our amazing RV garage, about 45 feet deep if I remember right. Go peek at the front yard, the front of the house, and then we'll wrap that up. All right. Sun's coming in. All right, there we go. So here's the front of the home. So we're gonna have stone on this section here and around the corner, and then stone on that uh, section as well. Got our nice courtyard. So they're looking really good out here and the, they're about done with the, um, the roofing. Got a little bit more tile to put up once they finish the stucco color coat, which uh, I'm anticipating will be either this week or next. But anyways, it's really turning out well. If you wanna come have a look at it, the address is 2192 North Desert View Drive in Washington. Thanks so much.